Travis on the rollout. Plants, eludes, and Travis extends with his legs. He's got the first down and more in the plus territory. The running may increase even if it is on off-schedule plays. Eighth play of the drive is blown up in the backfield. Isaiah Moore again, the sixth-year senior. Outside of Thayer Thomas, it has not been great. Looks to throw and under pressure and drops by Malcolm Ray. Might work in NC State's favor. Ray and Jared Jackson, the interior defensive lineman. As Leary is complete to Devin Carter, veteran wideout, tumbles to the 25, a gain of 23, and he is a very big key. Yeah, it's a good job of Carter just working for his quarterback. He turns inside, sees Leary in trouble, and then immediately starts working in phase with him. Escaping to his right, he's going to work with him. And Devin Carter, he's one of those guys, got a lot of talent. The improvement on the offensive line has been significant. Travis rolling left in the direction of Pittman. On second down, Travis gets rid of it quickly for Pokey Wilson, who makes the catch. What a grab by Pokey Wilson. Travis looks right. Watch Wilson, who high points the football, and the Knolls convert. Travis looks right. Watch Wilson, who high points the football, and the Knolls convert. Yeah, and they rush five, NC State does. They come after him, which means you get a one-on-one -on -one opportunity, and you got Johnny Wilson. From 47 yards for Ryan Fitzgerald. With the kick on its way, and good. Good to see Kevin Knowles back on the field for Florida State. This is Jordan Houston. He rumbles for a first down. Having a tough, hard-nosed football team, and... Seems like they just continue to re replace talent. There's Jordan Travis with a ton of running room into the open field. And Jordan Travis runs out of bounds inside the 20. They're done with the quarterback runs. You see them playing downhill to the running back. And Jordan Travis just says, I'm going to keep this and go out the back door. And then nobody is accounting in terms of how you defend the, the traditional run game. On first down toward the end zone for Pittman! Oh, what a catch! When you run the inside fade, you have all this room around you. So you, it can be, it's man coverage, it can be a back shoulder throw to allow him to adjust to it. And you, know, you just want to put it right on him. The coaching point oftentimes is throw it to the back of his helmet and then Pittman with his left arm tangled up is able to make a play on the football. If you're going to see the Jordan Travis of previous years, you're going to see him carrying the football quite a bit. Trayshawn Ward with running room. Makes a cut on Tanner Engel. Taken down inside the 30 by Shaheem Battle. Second down and 10. Houston out of the backfield. And Jordan Houston with a chunk play for NC State in the plus territory. He's going to have... Houston coming out of the backfield, and he just kind of gets caught up in the traffic there. That creates Houston, you know, to, to get all in that open space, be wide open there, and do, you see Leary do it. Demi Sumo Karnbe, the running back. Leary to throw, looking for somewhere to go, and it's picked off. Jamie Robinson, the interception on fourth down. Benson left side. Benson a first down. Shakes a tackle. Gets free from Thomas and tumbles down. Just gets run through by Benson. Screen for Pittman. Thomas makes another good tackle. It would be Tyler Baker Williams if he were healthy. But he's got the ankle injury. And now running room. And Lawrence Toa Phillies into the end zone. Touchdown Florida State. Shane McDonough to boot it away. And Micah Pittman bluffs it. Pokey Wilson picks it up. 
And Pokey Wilson past the 50. And Pokey Wilson in the plus territory with 10 seconds to go. And Florida State trying to add on here before halftime. This is an amazing special team. It's been a nice surprise for this Florida State defense. UCF transfer, the second leading tackler. Leary to the air. Sideline, and there's one of those contact catches you were talking about. Keon Lesane, the grab. So NC State trying to grab some offensive continuity here. Now to halftime. Here's Demi Sumo Kargbe springing forward. And still not down. Houston remains in. You saw Sumo Kangbe seated on the Wolfpack sideline. Leary over the middle for a touchdown. Daryl Jones, and what a start to the second half for NC State. Travis keeps speed to get past Peyton Wilson, and Travis turns the corner with a first down run out by Pitts. All-time points leader here at NC State. And Chris Dunn makes it a four-point game in the final minute of this third quarter. There Thomas in motion. Thomas to throw. Back to Chambers. And well defended. Josh Farmer stayed home. Them to take a very long field goal attempt. From 53 yards for Dunn. And he is good. It and it's playing a good defense in a really tightly contested game. Chambers keeps. And he cuts upfield for a first down. He had a banged up coming in. And injured here in this one as well. So it's Mims, and he's got a first down. Whoever it is, change at quarterback. Just 0 for 1 through the air since he came on for Devin Leary. Chambers spins and brought down. Heck of a play by Tatum Bethune making the stop on Jack Chambers. Yeah, Mike, and you asked what. Travis downfield. For Johnny Wilson, who makes the catch. Toa Philly on first down, picks up a couple of yards. Aggressive than that, get it as close to as the end zone as I possibly can, but I'm trying to score. Toa Philly out of the backfields. Peyton Wilson dumps him. Time. With all three timeouts, it's third and inches for Toa Philly to convert. He goes inside the 25, eight-yard line. Travis throws. Left side, locks it, and Blinken's there to pick it off! Wow! Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.